Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you've never seen my face before, I am the Miss Nicole Marie. Today we're having another mini vlog. Today we're actually going to go to Universal. They just started their Halloween Horror Nights, uh, which is actually not nights anymore. It's just during the day. Um, today I am filming this. It is October 3rd. It is their first day of continuing to do the Haunted Houses every single day until I think November 3rd is when they end that. So this is the very first day that they're doing this. I'm going to take you along and see what they're doing. Um, I'm not going to obviously film the haunted houses. I'll leave that as a surprise if you do end up going, obviously, and you're really not allowed to film in the haunted houses. I'm just going to take you around and see if there's any scare zones, if they're doing any decorations, anything like that. So I'm excited to see what they're doing this year. Um, I know things are a lot different because of COVID, so hopefully we can still have a lot of fun and see what they're going to do. So please stay tuned and we're going to get straight on into the video. It's good. Yeah. We held hands doing that just in case. It's pretty good. It's just really weird to go during the day. So we'll see. We're going to the next one at 11. So we're going to go probably walk around Harry Potter World and see what's next. Because we got some time for the next one. Yeah. Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah. Yeah. We'll see you soon. Perfect.
So we just got out of the tribute store. I got this little red velvet cake. And we're gonna probably go find a place to eat these. What do you get, Brick? Cookie dough pup. It looks like a little monster. I'll show you a better look when we get them out. All right, here's my red velvet cake pop thing. Brooks little monster. Cookie dough. It's really tiny. It's cute though. We're gonna eat these, see how they taste. Okay. I'm kind of afraid to eat this eyeball. <laughs> Our snacks were delicious. We had to go run to the bathroom because my hands were all messed up. And we passed by this little commercial shoot going on. So we're gonna show you what that's about. Give you a little sneak peek into this commercial that they're shooting.
All right, so we just got out of the, what was it called? The something tooth fairy? Revenge of the tooth fairy. Revenge of the tooth fairy. And that one definitely made us jump a few times. It was a good haunted house. Even though I've never heard of like a scary tooth fairy story, but it was pretty good. What do you think? It was good. It was good? Yeah. Did you jump a lot? <laughs> <You> shut up. <laughs> she jumped a little bit, but so did I. I went hell hands again because so it was pretty she scary. The yeah, I think you took over going first yeah. halfway to. I was sick of I was I trying to keep the distance in front of us. I kept the distance. Yeah, until the people in front of us like ran, I think, yeah. at one point. Because yeah. <laughs> we lost them. And I was like, what the heck? I was so confused in there. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty much it. I think we're going to get um, some twisted tater tots or something. And that might be it. So, we'll see you in a second for that. Look at those twisted taters. We got the salt and vinegar ones. Ooh. How is it? Yummy. Salty. Salty? Ugh, you can't get it. Salty. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that vinegar taste. All right, we're gonna finish this up and then we're probably gonna leave because it's starting to sprinkle. So that will be the end. I will come back with my final results when I get home. And we'll see you then. Cheers. All right, we just got back home. Um, that was definitely a lot more different than what I'm used to with Halloween Horror Nights. I've gone for the past couple of years. If you've gone, you know what it's like. It's very different this year. Um, very weird to go during the day, I might say. It's something brand new. Um, I know it will be getting darker earlier and they are open till 9 o'clock on the weekends. So it might still be dark um, sometimes. But we did go really early because it is the first day that they are open and they're starting this everyday haunted houses. So we got there early, which was good because it does get really busy. I was a little disappointed that there wasn't any scare zones or even decorations. You know, scare zones were kind of up in the air and not sure how they would do that. But definitely I thought there would be a little bit more decorations or something like that. And I didn't see any of that, which was kind of disappointing. Um, the two haunted houses that they have are really nice. Um, you feel definitely pretty safe in them. They have people stopping you in some points throughout the haunted house to make sure you're still keeping distance between the people in front of you and behind you. They also have all of the people who are jumping out of you. Um, they're pretty much behind a plexiglass, so they're not going to breathe on you or anything like that. And I think they're all pretty much wearing masks inside as well so I feel very safe and comfortable going there. They give you hand sanitizer before and after the haunted houses as well and I don't know if they're going to continue doing this but they did only a virtual lines for the haunted houses so it does make it a lot easier to just not have to wait in line really. I think we waited maybe five minutes tops for the first one and then the second one we pretty much just walked right on so it's nice not having to wait in the lines but you do have to just wait for your time that you reserve so if you do that make sure you have the app and you reserve the times early in the morning other than that there wasn't too much going on um, everything pretty much was the same as usual so they do have some of the food that they had last year with the twisted tater tots um, twisted potatoes that kind of thing. The tribute store is open that like you saw I filmed in there as well. Other than that there's just really pretty much same old same old going on. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Hopefully you got something out of it whether you're going or plan on going. Um, this is gonna be what it's pretty much gonna be like I think for the whole month 
there's not going to be a whole lot going on, but I'm glad they at least have two haunted houses so that we can at least have a little bit of Halloween fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up down below if you liked it, if it was helpful, informative for you guys. Also, don't forget to subscribe down below. Click the bell notification so you're notified of every time I post a brand new video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!